All right, welcome to episode three from our chapter eight series on photosynthesis. And this episode is only going to cover this one slide that you see here because we're going to talk about what is NADPH and what is NAD+. Okay, uh, NADP plus is an electron carrier. All right, think of it like a pickup truck. It's going to grab an electron, throw it in the bed, and carry it to where it needs to go. All right, now a couple things I do want you to, to notice is that you see this plus right here? That means it has a positive charge. Electrons have a negative charge, so anything that's negative will be attracted to that. Now, electrons are so small that you've got to carry them on something, and they're carried on a hydrogen. So over here, I want you to write, I want you to put it right over here. Think of hydrogens are going to carry electrons. In fact, they're going to carry two electrons. So. When NADP plus picks up its cargo of NAP, I'm sorry, let me rephrase this one. When NADP plus picks up its cargo of electrons, it's going to be called NADPH, okay? Now, we're going to learn about, in another chapter, we're going to learn about another electron carrier. I want you to remember that this P refers to photosynthesis. It stands for something else. But later in our next series of screencasts for Chapter 9, you're going to need to remember that the P stands for photosynthesis. See? P, P, P right there. All right. So what happens here is the light-dependent reactions, they're going to give off an electron. That electron is going to go to NADP+. And when NADP+, picks up an electron, it's NADPH. And that's going to be delivered to the Calvin cycle, okay? So I want you to write here next to this that when it's NADPH, it's carrying electrons, okay? Now, NADPH is going to drop off its electrons at the Calvin cycle. And when it does that, it's going to turn into NAD. P plus, because the electrons went to here, okay? So now it's going to cycle back. It's going to come back here to the light-dependent reactions, where it's going to pick up an electron. It's a constant cycle. So this would be called the NADPH, NADP plus cycle. So let's add one more little tidbit of information right here, okay? So we'll put down not carrying... An electron okay so the light dependent reactions give electrons the Calvin cycle takes the electrons and these electrons are going to be used to make glucose okay I'm not going to go on detail in the, into the chemical structure a ton here at, really at all we just want to keep it simple NADPH carries electrons so think of NADP as the pickup truck for electrons during photosynthesis so NADPH is full, NADPH, NADP plus is empty, all right? Try not to get confused. You might want to look at this episode a couple of times. Until the next time, we'll catch you on the flip side.